Hey, well, good morning. Bless you today. Happy to be with you this morning. Welcome to Said Talks. This is Pastor Said here with my, listen, this is my Santa shirt. That's single and out of shame. I'm no longer single, of course, but I have that shirt still around. It's nice and bright, bright yellow. My goodness, it's a bright shirt. Okay. <laughs> but I wonder where it is. It fits well. It fits well. Well, good morning. Good morning. Bless you today. Hope that you're having a wonderful day. Honey, good morning. Honey, you were with me this morning. And you're always with me, of course, but I'm good to see you there. Uh, we're in another room of the house, guys, if you don't know that for sure. But guys, this morning we are looking forward to talking uh, about talking to ourselves as individuals. You know, the Bible talks about how in Jude, in Jude 20, uh, Jude 20, there's only one chapter in Jude. Jude says, uh, but ye, uh, uh, beloved, be building up yourselves in your most holy faith and, and praying in the Holy Ghost. That, that's what we do. Uh, we build ourselves up by, by speaking to ourselves. You know, the Bible talks about us that we do speaking to ourselves, speaking among ourselves in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, making melodies in our heart unto the Lord. Hey, Craig, good to see you. Bless you this morning. And there is Mike. Mike, good to see you. Mike Cleveland, bless you. And But we speak to ourselves. Often we talk about people that are, let's say, of the world. Uh, when you go around talking to yourself, people think you're crazy. <laughs> okay, People think that you lost your mind when you start talking to yourself and you're having all kind of conversations with yourself and answering yourself and doing different things. I, I talk to myself a lot. I even answer myself. I have a I even put on I put on plays, if you will, in my mind, okay? And then actually begin to work work them out. Now it's not what I'm being obnoxious about it. That's not the end, end all be all here. But what we're looking to do is encouraging ourselves in the Lord and encouraging and building ourselves up. You know, there's nobody else that will care for you like you care for yourself. And then so if we begin to communicate, I mean, communicating to God is one thing. That's one that we, we talk to God. That's fantastic. We got to continue to do that. But also to speak to ourselves. I'm talking about just really saying kind things about ourselves. You know, I am the, I am the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. I can do all things through Jesus Christ who strengthens me. You see, I walk by faith and not by sight. So when I speak to myself like that, and I'm having a word coming to me, uh, good morning, uh, Michelle, good morning, Eddie, good to see you, bless you. And we speak to ourselves, we're building ourselves up in our most holy faith. And it's not a, up to these, bless you, we just talked about you the other day, girl, in New York, bless you today. How wonderful, we had a, t t had a wonderful tour there in New York. If you ever go to New York, see Al Tavis, Al Tavis, she's right here on Facebook. You get a tour of Harlem, she'll give you a nice walking tour. You better be in shape because she's walking fast, okay? <laughs> Well, listen, guys, we're talking about talking to ourselves and, and how important it is to speak to ourselves positively and encourage ourselves. Not always easy, but it is something important because, again, we can talk down to ourselves. We can think negatively of ourselves. The Bible says, as a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. And that same man that thinks in his heart may as well think and even begin to say the things that he's thinking. Because as we think in our heart and we begin to act 